Well, good afternoon, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Motor home in fun, and what a glorious September afternoon we've got on Southwold Camping at the moment. So we're heading out on our second main walk of the day, and we're going to head up the estuary, up the harbour, and hopefully get to Warberswick, guys. So there is a little boat crossing, or I think we can do the walk, which is a hell of a lot longer but um obviously better for us and we'll see a little bit more of the local scenery so let's take you on our walk right so we're going to head out the campsite at the very bottom gate today and um once we get there we'll take a right up towards the harbour and all the old shacks etc we're not being up that way yet we have flown the drone over it looks quite nice impressive and that so let's give it a go guys weather is stunning right so we're going to head out the pathway and then take a right turn let's see if we can see any information on that little boat crossing let's see if it's even running right so Warberswick is on the other side literally What's that? 50 metres? Not even that. But um, we're going to wander up to the top. Certainly have a look at this harbour area and the shacks. And if we don't want to go further, we'll come back and um, possibly take the boat. We'll see how much it costs, guys. But no idea whatsoever. So I guess this is a kiosk. Oh, you get your little ticket from, I would have thought. Let's say boat trips. I think that is just a general boat trip. Right, let's walk along. Right, this is the ferry here. Opens daily, 10 till 5. Warberswick, river trips, private hire, school parties, dogs welcome, don't know how much it costs, £20, one hour trip, it's just that's a trip, so I'm not sure whether it's a ferry, across or not, oh adults £2, children a pound. dogs welcome, so we'll have a look at that, maybe come back that way we'll just take a slow wander up here right just have a quick scan round beautiful day right so these are the fishermen's shacks little restaurants cafes fish and chips crab platter mixed platter cod goujons fish for sale right fine today cod and chips add it place cod nine pounds chips three pound fifty this was mr Tease, fish and chips. I think that's the one I heard had burnt down. As I say, just interesting coming up this way. Well, we'll see if we can get the drone up and back down, I think, later. I do love little old quaint places like this to come and have a look at. A little bit of background noise guys, somebody working on an old boat. Oh, 
Right, might even get the drone up now. We can go backwards and forwards from here. Right, we'll continue our walk further up. We did have a drone flight there. Looked pretty good on the screen, so um, it's hard to tell until you do the editing and get back and that, guys. But um, as I say, when it's a glorious day like this, it normally looks quite good. Blue skies, etc. Normally come away this time of year, and um, I think we've been pretty lucky with weather over the last four or five years. We always choose the second week in September once the schools have gone back. I think at this very end it's probably the, the yacht club. Another dining place there. At the moment, we're about three quarters of a mile from the campsite, so um, not too bad. I say, I'm just hoping there is a crossing up here. There are some people walking the other side, so it's, it does look hopeful. More fresh fish, some anchors. Fresh fish landed today. And this is South World Sailing Club. Harbour Inn. So that's the Harbour Inn. That's your beverage. Food served as well. Adnums, you can probably see 1953, the flood level was halfway up that building. Got some lovely properties, just there. Alright, we'll head through here. Turning out a lovely day this for the walks we've been doing. Right, so I think there is a bridge crossing. So um, it's going to be about a mile to the bridge. So we've got a mile back down the other side of the estuary. So it'll wander about Warberswick. And if we want to come back this way as well, we've got another mile to the crossing and a mile back. So it could end up being a four, four and a half mile walk. Or otherwise you take the ferry and shorten it for two pounds which we might well do guys
does look like there's another footpath to the right. I'm guessing that will lead all the way to Southwold. A little country walk. But um, we're going to head across this crossing. Right, so this is the footbridge. And we were 0.95 miles on the campsite. This is looking back down the, the estuary. Obviously boats can't come any further than this. As you see, you can go further. If you've got a little smaller boat that can go under. Looks like there's an old windmill in the distance, got no sails on. Actually quite beautiful. I've got a feeling we're coming up to high tide now, so um it's probably at its highest level today. Right, we're gonna take a left here. And there's a footpath, a bridle way down that way, but I'm pretty sure Warbers Wick is down here. Right, so we're looking across now, across the harbour. And we've got this pathway now all the way to Warberswick. No, this way, Sky. Well, this is actually a nice, pleasant walk, everybody. Don't dismiss the walk, guys. And that, I know it's a couple of mile, and that, but there is the option of getting a little ferry boat back. Right, so that is the ferry pickup. As I say, two pound for adults, one pound child under five free bicycles two pound dogs welcome pay on boat inside that shed shed we've got some postcards for sale right so this is Warbus Wick coming up some flood markers on those sheds they're halfway up those sheds 1953 look like they had a really big flood here big car park as well if you wanted to drive here obviously you've got to do your map route to get here guys we're using the roads Right, let's go and have a look. We're a mile and three quarters, guys, to this point, so not too bad. Looks like we've got the bell in just up here on the left. Have a little wander right this way. Sure, everybody. That's the Bell Inn, Abenhams again, the local brewery. 
Hello. Beer garden, accommodation, food served here. So we're just on a general wander. I don't really know anything about this place, what's around here, what there is to do. So it's just a little look round. And when we get the opportunity, we'll, we'll get the drone up somewhere. Obviously the village green. Some shops. On the other side, far side. It looks an interesting shot this. A lot of old memorabilia. Ice creams, the parish lantern, shop, tea room, and garden. There's no water in it, darling. We'll find us some water somewhere. The tea shed, breakfast, lunch, dog friendly. See if there's any water for Sky. Right, we take a wander down here. Not too sure what's up here. Maybe we'll have a quick little walk. I guess it's another public house. Yes, it is. The anchor. And this is as far as we'll go. Looks like residential houses up here. Right, so that's the anchor. Right, we're going to head, I guess, probably to the beach area now. A little wonder for sky and get the drone up right so this is down to the beach it says it does say narrow bridge but it also does say parking so i think these cars are waiting for a clear opportunity to um get along right this is a wedding party in front we're all going down for photos on the beach and drinks i believe head down to warberswick beach few minutes and then we'll come back so we've got the wedding party on our right hand side Can't imagine this being dog restricted, but um, we never know. Right, looks like we've got a, a shingle pebbly beach this side. This is the sort of beach we'll get in Oldborough.
reach the end as far as we can go here. Right, so there's the views back down the beach. Right, walk back this way, takes us over to the ferry boat or the footpath.
Okay, mate. Come on, Sky. As you see, these buildings are on a small stilt. Obviously, they're worried about the floods. I should imagine the 1953 floods, they were flooded. Right, so I think we're going to catch the, the ferry this time. Right, so we've got to wait for the next ferry or rowing boat, as they say. Well, I think we could have a the motorised version. There's two ferries. The girl has got a rowing boat one and the male has got a motorised one, so that's for us. Hello, mate. Hello there. Well done. Oh, nice one. Excellent. Okay. I don't know what I thought. I was going to put the stone out, please. Right, that was a ferry, short and sweet. Try to get a little bit of film in there for you guys. Right, so we're going to head back now. Afternoon coffee and chocolate eclair. Right, so that was a thoroughly enjoyable walk this afternoon to Warberswick. Hope you enjoyed it as well, guys. And then we did. I might even be tempted to come back tomorrow and do Simlo again. Possibly get the ferry across and then walk back.
right everybody I think we're going to conclude this little walk at the harbour here so thank you very much for watching till the end if you have done guys and that don't forget to give us a comment and a like and all that and um, also if you want to see more content like this in the future don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell so we'll see you all tomorrow bye for now <laughs>